Good afternoon, everybody. And blessings to everybody in the name of Jesus Christ, the Most High Creator. The one, the beginning and end. Well, I'm trying to hear the beautiful movie of David, story of David, and how he became king and other trials and other stuff he had to go through to become king. And it's a beautiful movie. I thought it wasn't going to be that good, but it's beautiful. Well, this is not the subject I'm going to speak about. The subject I'm going to be, speak about is about the herbal store I was in and about all the witchcraft and idolatry items they got there. Idolatry, basically. And how they burn essence and stuff. This lady... She seemed pretty nice and sincere, but she was clearly ignorant about uh, well, witchcraft, or she wasn't. She was just, uh, she just didn't care. There's many people in this world that don't care, but they have to care and be able to uh, perceive the truth. And obey the truth because if you know Jesus Christ, you obey the truth because you love Him, you love God, you know. And it's a journey. That's a journey on itself. Different subject, but uh, it's not easy to follow the truth if you're really in in the truth and Jesus Christ, you know, the, and that spiritual journey. Many people are just, you know, ignorant and caught up in unawares. And I was just trying to bring awareness to this lady. And uh, she just had excuse after excuse. I told her, you know, you're not supposed to be putting up idol, idols and burning essence, worshiping idols. and, and um, Because that's a form of witchcraft. And, well, it is a form of witchcraft, and it does invite demonic spirits I couldn't talk to her um, that'll bring destruction in your life and that does, does invite demonic spirits that will bring destruction in your life and uh, well death basically destruction death and uh, bad luck because you reap what you sow in my witchcraft they're doing burning essence and all this other stuff all forms might bring good luck temporarily, but in the long run, it will bring you a lot of bad luck and you'll reap what you sow, a lot of destruction. And, uh, <clears throat> well, that lady, she was basically ignorant and uh, unaware. And I asked her about who God is to her and what her faith is. And she said, oh, we have all have the same idea of God. And, well, that's not true at all, actually. I didn't tell her that's not true. You know, so a lot of people have, you know, uh, different opinions about who God is and and their faith and religion. Their faith, basically. And, uh, well, they could have different opinions about their faith and who God is, but the real, the truth is that Jesus Christ is God, you know. That's the number one truth. And, well, you would only get to that unless if you're um, in that path. That's the truth way in the life. And then... Uh, Asked her if she believes in Jesus Christ, and <clears throat> so I asked her um, who God is to her, and she said, uh, "Well, we had the all had the same idea," and she couldn't quite give me a clear answer to it. And then I, and she couldn't quite answer me who God is to her until I asked her if she believes in Jesus Christ. 
And well, she said yes. And I'm pretty sure she doesn't know or she does she just doesn't care that uh if you're in that path of truth and if you truly love God and Jesus Christ, you wouldn't you wouldn't be obedient to him. That's the truth, you know. It wouldn't be uh I'm not saying she's practicing this witchcraft and idolatry thing, but she does sell it to people, obviously. And uh, I'm not against people making money and uh, working and stuff, but the truth is the truth, you know. And I asked the other lady, the customer, and she couldn't give me a clear answer either. And stuff. Uh, so she'll hold my question. I asked her if she believes in Jesus Christ. And by that time, I was done asking and searching out what type of faith they have and the truth. <clears throat> no, I was really... Uh, Little, I felt like a little, I love this high um, fog around me and this witchcraft uh, taking me down a tall little, draining my energy, so I just had to go get out of there. I felt like this darkness in there, I just, just couldn't uh, handle it, I just went out. Whether you're aware of it or believe in it or don't care or not, do not um supposed to be um, putting up idols and burning incense and practicing witchcraft if you truly believe in Jesus Christ or God. And uh, everybody has their journey, but the truth is, you know, you will be aware of that that's wrong and that's of, you know, Satan, the devil, and it's true because it brings destruction to people, you know, and uh, themselves, too. And that's just the truth. <clears throat> we all have a sin and the wrong thing that we're doing, but we have to um, put in the effort in order to obey the truth and the uh, commandment of God, you know, because he loved us before the foundation of the world, and, and uh, give us unconditional love, we have to follow the truth and well, obey it, uh, I hope this helped, in the name of Jesus Christ, amen, I'll be leaving greetings to you and blessings in the name of Most High, amen.